Hey Elevate Phoenix family, Jasmine Hall, Development Director of Elevate Phoenix. We are so excited to continue sharing about our Thankful Thursdays, about all of our alumni who have taken different paths. And today you're about to hear from a young man by the name of Malachi, and he has taken the path of military and armed forces. I can't wait for you to hear his story. Matter of fact, he's just joining in. Let's go. Yes, I got you. <laughs> well, Malachi, as you know, as I shared, we want to highlight you on our Thankful Thursdays and talk about our alumni who has taken the path of military. So if you don't mind, just share with us a little bit about who you are, how you got into our program, a little bit about the impact Elevate has made for you, and then your path over there with the military and share what branch and all that fun stuff that you're in. It's been amazing. I've been in for 36 months, so three years. I'm actually going to be a senior airman, which is an E4. Congratulations. Um, it's, it's given me a lot of opportunities that a lot of people at my rank won't have. So I got to fly in helicopters, um, support nuclear convoy missions. Um, I get to repel a lot. Um, like, so anything that has to do with like nuclear security, I, I pretty much have done. In 2015, I was a freshman, which is crazy to think about. I know, um, right? <laughs> <laughs> and um, I walked into class. They had like a huge circle going. It looked, it looked like an intervention. I was like, <laughs> I was like, what is going on here? <laughs> and I just, like, take a seat. And they were just, inter everybody was introducing themselves. and. I think from there, you know, like I just knew, like it was, I, like I, I belong there. It really took a, a key development of who I am because it, it's not just all oh, my senior year I was in that class or my junior to senior. It was like freshman all the way to the end. It's it's been more impactful than I really thought it would. I actually still keep in contact with Mr. Chavez, Mr. Moss, Moses. Uh, Mr. Amanda, like all, I still keep in contact with all of them. So they, they, it's not just a one year thing or two year thing. It's like, if you really want to connect with, with the mentors that you have, like they're really there. A lot of people in our age will try to figure out everything before they're 21, 22, 23. Like you have more more time like than, than we think we have. Um, we don't need to have everything figured out right now. So just try a lot of things. I'm only 21. I'm still trying to try different things. Like I'll be getting out next year. I'll be doing real estate. All right. Uh, so yeah, and I'll be going to school full time as well. Love it. I love it. Well, we are so grateful and so honored, not only that you've gone through our program, not just that you're our alumni, but for your service. We are so grateful. And so thank you to you and thank you to all of our you know, supporters who have invested in people like you and all of our kids. We're just so grateful. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your support.